This is the daily video update for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. Today is Wednesday, August 26th, 2020. One of the things that I'm doing this week uh, is updating the congregation on, on uh, what's been going on in my life uh, of ministry outside of the specific work that I do for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. And a place that I get a lot of questions about that uh, is about uh, the, the progress uh, towards my Doctorate of Ministry program. Um, as you might remember, this spring uh, I started a, a demon program at Wesley Theological, uh, which is my uh, alma mater uh, for seminaries. Um, and a doctorate of ministry is really the the um, a capstone degree uh, for ministers. It, it differs from a PhD. Um, because it's a professional degree rather than an academic one. So in some ways it is more like uh, a law doctorate or a medical doctorate uh, than it is a PhD. Um, the program that I'm in also assumes, as most uh, doctorate of ministry programs do, uh, that the folks in it will be working as um, pastors of churches while they are in it. So rather than being uh, in Washington, D.C. for classes full-time, the basic structure is uh, you spend the first six weeks of a class um, doing all the reading and, uh, and engaging with the texts of the course, then one week of intense engagement in person in Washington, D.C., and then another six weeks of writing uh, afterwards. So it works out to be about the length of a semester, but only one week of that 13-week um, series is actually in person. Um, practically what that means is once or twice a year uh, I'll travel to DC, um, but I, I will still live in Lincoln um, and, and uh, be the pastor at the Unitarian Church. Um, let's see. Classes are over uh, for now. Um, I took a couple classes in the spring semester. I probably won't uh, this fall, just because of the way the class schedule works. I'll probably pick up again in January. Um, but the classes were really good. It was good to engage with um, colleagues and engage uh, with, with the academic study of religion um, and to be part of that, part of that world again. Um, if you're interested, one of the things that I'll, I'll attach to this video um, is a, a paper I wrote uh, for an ecclesiology um, course this spring. So if you're, if you're curious about what, uh, what seminary writing looks like um, as, as opposed to sermon writing or these updates, um, that should give you a, a pretty good idea. Um, I'm really, I'm really glad to be in the program, and I'm, I'm glad to be in a congregation that supports uh, my doing that work. It's a long program. I'll be in it for the next three years, um, but, uh, but it really feeds back into the work that I do for the congregation, uh, even as I bring uh, parts of my work for the congregation to that program. Um, I'm sure we'll have more opportunity to check in on that, but uh, that's that's a good update for now. Other than that, uh, the only other thing going on right now, uh, there's a lot of things going on right now, but the only other thing uh, that's that's uh, worth announcing now is that our signups for Stacy and I's bike tour of Lincoln uh, continue to be live. Um, so if you would like, uh, go back and watch yesterday's daily update um, and sign up uh, for, for us to come visit uh, socially distanced your house uh, over a weekend in September. We'll be biking around the city and stopping at as many Unitarian households as we can over two weekends. See you tomorrow and have a great night.